Hey guys, as you know, I like to get right to it. These are the tools you need. Hammer or claw, small screwdriver, needle nose pliers, and Allen wrench. But you don't need all of them. You need the small one right there. I wanna show you first with a little screwdriver and the claw. It's a little bit more difficult to get the screwdriver into this place, but once you do, you can do the claw and you can just pry right up with the screwdriver. Boom, your table's out. Not my favorite way. Next, let's try the claw and the Allen wrench. You'll notice the Allen wrench actually fits in between the staple, get the claw, boom. Nice, I like that way a lot. Now the drawback to using this guy is sometimes it'll turn on you and you won't be able to catch it. So you have to get it just right in order to pull it up, but it works really good. Now, let's show you using this guy and the hammer. You'll notice I can just slip this guy right into the place. Voila. I really like this method. However, let's show you using a needle nose pair of pliers and the hammer. Some of these will be really difficult to get to, so you'll have to put the front end of the needle nose pliers right into place, take the claw, and pull right up. Also another easy way to do it. If you prefer to use the pry tool, you can put the edge of the needle nose pliers, use the pry tool, and done. Now, you may be better with a pry tool than a hammer, your choice, but these are household tools that you usually have lying around in your toolbox. Again, this is a super easy method, but you have to make sure you have the alignment. This one, it's okay, and if that's all you have, then that's great. This one will work even if this won't fit into the eye hole. Now let's say you have a really tough one like this one where it, the Allen wrench, it won't fit into the eye hole, but you do have a pair of needle nose pliers. That makes it a little bit easier to use these guys because you can grab it, use your hammer and pull up with just pinching it. So that works even without being able to use your Allen wrench for removing staples. I hope this helps you guys. It totally, totally helped me a lot. So that's Colorado Deep Guy. Please like and subscribe.